Hello everyone, this is King Cornell T. This video I will show you our new product. We have designed this KC868 AI board that is used for the input module. So this will have 48 uh, digital input channel and also will support IR receiver and IF receiver so that you can use the TV or air conditioning uh, remote or oh, this 433 MHz remote uh, used by this board. And this board also we have designed based on the ESP32 module and it can easily to integrate to Home Assistant by the ESP Home. Also you can write the Arduino IDE code so that you can read the input uh, for this digital input and uh, send the command and uh, communication with this IS232 port or also support the IS485 port you can support by the mode bus protocol and you can see here you can see the ethernet port and the esp32 and the usb download cable and the remote and the rf uh, so this uh, used for the input uh, used for your sensor and used for your wall switch and any dry contact device can be connected with this board and also there is a i square c extend so you can extend many input uh, device uh, for I square C bus. And then let's look at this hardware details. Okay, let's look at this is the AI board. Uh, this is in front of a PCB. And this is the back. And this should also in support install on the thing rail. You can see that will be very easy to install on the thing rail. So that you can install this board to your power distribution box. And let's look at this, some hardware details. And this blue, that is digital input. You can see here is 1, 2, 3, 4 until 24. So this 24 channel of the digital input. And here you can see that is 25 and until 48. So this is another uh, 24 channel of digital input. So the totally have 48 digital input so you can easily use for sensor or in the use for wall switch and I use this board or work with the relay controller and this black is ground that is KCOM because we, because we have this board that is our old board this switch terminal board is uh, the relay controller for max 32 channel and this time you can use this board and replace this one so that you can use the wall switch and connect with the sensor uh, used by one board and this board new board also you can see here I have IS232 interface and connect with the relay controller or connect with other IS232 device and this also is IS232 uh, just a different terminal different ship and this is IS485 so that A, B, and ground. So that we, we can, you can use it for long distance, uh, work with the little controller. And this is the Ethernet. And here you can see some free uh, GPIO you can use. That you can use, just a free GPIO. And this is the ESP32 module. And this is USB that is downloaded the freeware and downloaded the Arduino code uh, by this part. And this time you can see here the IR receiver so that uh, you can use this uh, air conditioning remote and the TV remote or other IR remote so you can press the button you can send the uh, signal uh, to this IR receiver and uh, you can write the Arduino code uh, for your remote uh, to continually uh, or no problem and also you can see here is the socket the black socket that is the for RF 433 MHz receive module so you can just plug in this module so that you can use any remote uh, just uh, use RF remote and you can country uh, the other device and you can write the Arduino code and the code is the key code uh, by this code okay and this is the power uh, that is 12 volt and the power supply so you can see here some resource, uh, just a digital input and uh, IR receiver, RF receiver 
And so this board is used for get the date from the, the devices and uh, for different devices. So that you can integrate to Home Assistant very easily. Also, you can support by the ESP Home. We have write the complete the ESP Home config file I share with you. And here you can see also have I square C extend. That is I square C extend. So this board uh, can use for extend your input uh, module for your home automation. And okay, thanks for watching.